What's going on, guys? It's Kenny with Kenny Made. All right, so they did a midweek release of um, some new legends here. So I wanted to go over that, open some packs, see what we can pull, see if we can get lucky. Um, we got Larry Allen, Rod Woodson, and Morton Anderson. Um, those were the three that came out. Again, we will have more on Saturday. I'm not sure they're going to continue this midweek um, release of card uh, legends. I think that was just maybe a one-time thing. But let's go over. Um, let's open some packs. Let's see what they see if we can pull one of them. See what they look like. Um, you know, if I don't pull any, then we'll just go and check them out in the auction block. Getting 89 kicker this early would actually be really nice just for those long field goals that, you know, we get stuck into having to try to kick. So let's see what we can pull on these. So, so gold. There we go. So we'll take the gold and we'll take the high silvers. Round number two here, we get a 75. 75, 77, 75. All right, that was not great. Round number two, we're gonna get an elite. So we get an 80, an 83, and our legend is an 83 Merlin Olsen. So we're gonna, I'm gonna take over the legend because even if I don't sell it, I can put it in the exchange set and try to pull something better from there. So let's just go ahead, let's get into the next packs here. Let's keep them going, see if we can get lucky. All right, so start with 65. Hey, we get a gold right away. 63, 67, 62, 62. Okay, so we'll take 65, 67, and 63 as well. Round number two, we get a 79, close to elite. But we do get an elite. Oh, we get two, actually. There we go, that's nice. Round number three, 80 Bradley Chubb. 80 Kirk Cousins, which <laughs> his COVID response is hilarious. If I die... I die. And then we have Joe Thomas as our rookie or a legend. So we'll take Joe Thomas. You know, not the. I gotta I'm gonna be honest with you guys. These packs are not that great. I really. Unless a legend comes out that I really want, I don't foresee me opening these packs anymore. Just because, as you see, the what you pull is just nothing really worth it. For 120,000 uh, 120, coins, I can't make my coins back at all. I mean, that Chris, 86 Chris Jones is nice, but you just, unless you're pulling the high legends, you're not gonna get your stuff back. It's just not gonna happen. Um, so I don't recommend opening these packs, honestly. This will be the last, like I said, set of packs I do. I'll go over the. You know, legends with you guys always, but maybe open one, but I'm done. I don't want to open these because they're just, they're going to take all my coins for no reason. Because as you see, I'm not pulling anything, any fire or anything. It's all just simple base, bare, you know, 81, 80, 81. What are, how am I supposed to make 120k back on an 81 overall card? It's just not gonna happen. Um, EA does this every year. They put these packs, same with Ultimate Legends. You, you don't pull anything good. So what's the point of opening these packs if you can't get anything that's worthwhile? Um, <clears throat> it, it, you know what I mean? If you can't at least have a chance at, a higher chance at pulling something that's gonna help you you know, either sell to make mush your coins back or something like that, then there's no real reason for these packs. Because I've opened 40 some of these and I haven't pulled over an 85, which is pretty sad. If you can open that many of these packs and still not pull anything worthwhile. As you see, like, it's just constant, you know, eh, cards, nothing great. We get some silvers, golds now, boom, ooh. Round number three, we always get an elite, we get 80, 81, eight, 83. This is my point. Out of 10 packs here, our best pull is 85. And this is caught, that 85 only sells for like 
40 grand. So we've literally wasted everything trying to get these cards for no apparent reason. So we just need to hope EA actually stops putting out crappy packs or just decides, you know what, hey, let's just stop charging a million coins for something that's not worth it. But I doubt they're going to do that. 86, arm stretch. We're going to go 86 for sure right there just because that's our highest pull of the day. 86. When, you know, Legends are 89, 90, we're pulling 86s if we're lucky. So we got a couple more packs to finish. See what we can get. It's all just going to come down to, you know, do they actually care what we pull? 66s. Look at those cards, baby. 66s. Ooh, Platinum. I will be taking him. He's, he's 18k, but I'm still going to take him. So, 80 Buddha Baker, 80 Brandon Graham, and 81. Oh, 83. More special. Come on. Alright, so we got two more of these. Um, yeah. Not a big fan. I gotta be honest with you guys. Uh, don't waste your coins. Don't wait. Just don't waste your time on them. Unless there's a legend out that you're, re you know, that's the LTD that you're just really trying to pull, just ignore it. Just pretend these packs don't exist because it's just not worth it. As you see, I'm not. I haven't pulled anything great. You know, there's nothing to say. Look at what I pulled. Oh my god. Because you're just going to get upset that you wasted all your coins for a pack that should be better, but isn't. So this is our last one. Then we have the 285s that I'm going to open. But if we don't pull anything here, this is just absolutely pathetic by EA. But what more do you expect for them? At this point in the game, I mean, they just kind of do what they want and assume people are going to come running for their cards. So, 83. Woohoo! Yeah, guys, stay away from these packs. Um, nothing great about them. This is an 85. This is our best chance of pulling a full legend. And I'm going to pull two 85s. Ooh, this one's an 87, I think. Oh, no, we got full Jerry Rice, actually. That's actually a good card. But again, not in the regular pack. I had to get that. So, it's just, like I said, guys, personally, I don't think it's um, worth it. It's your guys' choice, though, at the end of the day. Um, you want to try, um, by all means. But I recommend you guys just stay away from them. Don't mess with them. They're not worth it. Um, other than that, guys, I appreciate you watching. Uh, it's not the world's longest video. Um, but I just want to go over the new legends. Like I said, let's go actually check them out. We got the kicker. We got Rod Woodson and Larry Allen were the three that came out today. So let's just hop over the um, auction block real quick and see their stats. Um, there is no tokens with them. They're released today. So don't worry about going and playing the challenges to get the token for the set. Those are um, not out yet. So let's go in here. Got legends. Quality is 88-89. And let's go type here. I believe he's a left guard, Larry Allen. Is he a right guard then? No, I think he's a guard. There we go. Alright, so this is Larry Allen. Yeah, so he is a right guard. Um, compare. Okay. So, we're going to compare him with 85 David DeCastro. So, he's got four, you know, overall on him. Ninety strength, eighty-five awareness, eighty-five pass block, eighty-eight um, pass block power, pass, pass block finesse, eighty-four run block, eighty-nine. I gotta say, overall, it's actually not a bad card. Larry Allen normally is one of those cards that you definitely you know, use a lot. Sixty-one speed, so for runs that helps. I gotta say, 
pretty decent. Uh, but he always has been very good in the game. Then we got Rod Woodson here. Uh, one of my favorite players in the game. Right here, 88 speed, which is great to have on your corner. Acceleration, agility, both 88s. Jumping, 85. Play rec, 87. Man coverage, 87. Zone, 85. And press is 81. And that's comparing him to Aeneas Williams, who is also an 89 overall. So I gotta say, pretty decent stats. Um, sadly, nothing that jumped out. I was like, oh my god, you have to have this corner. He just, he has really good stats. Um, let's go in here, and then we got Morton Anderson, the kicker. It's every year, you know, we get a good good kicker out the gate. So we got 88 kick power, 85 kick accuracy. I mean, honestly, those are the only two stats you really care about unless you're using him to do your um, fake um, field goals. Then he's only got 23 throw power, so careful on that but most people either run it or use the place kicker uh placeholder to throw the ball again most there are some that use the kicker to throw but it is what it is but those are the stats guys um you know pretty decent especially for the kick power which is what everyone should mostly be using a kicker for um so Hope you guys liked the video, you know, please do like, subscribe, and comment on the video. All that does help me out when you do it. I'm trying to, you know, get more subscribers up, get, you know, so if there's anything you guys want to see personally, just let me know in the uh, comments, and I will definitely work on that video. I'll get whatever videos you guys want to see. If you want to see more gameplay, you want to see me do a no money, no money spent pack and play series, or if you want to see, let me know. I'll definitely work on trying to get that out. Other than that, peace. See you next time.